What's wrong with his nose? Happy birthday, Dino. Thank you, Father. Oh, look at the pink hippo! Dana chose it. <laughs> it squeaks when you press it. Dino, you carry with you a very important legacy. You mean this card? No, I'm talking about the Santino dynasty. We go back a long way, right back to the 23rd century. Wow. <laughs> Leave the hippo alone, Dino. Sorry, Father. Now, here's your great-grandfather, Pino Santino. Evil genius, just like me. Did he really look like that? The artist caught him on a good day. And there's Auntie Teresa. She invented the 18-hour school day. Why isn't my picture on the wall? Do you know, you haven't really made your mark on the world yet. Not like Auntie Teresa. Will I be an evil genius one day? He is hoping. Father, would you still like me if I turn out not to be an evil genius? Yes, Dino. I'd just be very, very disappointed. <sighs> Stick out your tongue. Ah. Not you, Simone. I was talking to Boomba. <laughs> Looks fine to me. So what's wrong with him? Maybe it's a vitamin deficiency. I'll need to examine one of his hairs. <laughs> ah, we seem to have located the problem. Here's your birthday present, Dino. <gasps> it's one I've always wanted, a karaoke machine. No, Dino, this little baby is called a preconceiver. It's a prototype. Does it play music? No, but it enables you to see 30 minutes into the future. Think of the fun you'll have with it. So it's sort of like a crystal ball. Yes, Dino. I can be a gypsy and wear gold earrings. No, you can't, Dino. Why is there nothing on the screen? The preconceiver can only pick up remarkable events within a limited radius. It's not very accurate. It's more of a toy than anything else. What exactly is a remarkable event? Something especially unusual, like a, a national disaster or that time you were selected for the football team. Thank you, Father. I will treasure it, along with the pink hippo. <laughs> oh, Dino, why can't you be more like your father? <laughs>